Hi everybody, it's me. I wanted to give you guys an updated video on my doctor's visit. So as you know, I went to the doctor's today and, you know, everything went fine. Um, I'll give you guys my stats before I go in the video. Um, I started, my starting weight was 440. My surgery, surgery, surgery morning, I was a total of 396. And my current is 321, which means I have a total of 119 pound weight loss. Yay me. Um, so like I said, I went to the doctors today and everything seemed to be going fine. He said that um, most people that have to sleeve are at a 40% loss. He said I'm 60 and 60% 60 weight loss and he said to keep up the good work. He gave me some blood work to do, um, so I have to get that done either this week or next week, he said. Um, so I'll have that done. Um, he he went over my fears with my surgery and, and all that stuff. And basically, I don't eat salads um, and I don't eat any fruit. And he told me that I need to start trying those things and I said for me it's a fear because I'm scared to have dumping syndrome and what he told me is that I did not get the gastric bypass so I don't have dumping syndrome but I'm still scared of the stomach aches and everything and he said I'm he said honestly I'm glad that you like that so that way you um you know it's affecting you in a positive way so I'm going to start trying things slowly, um, an apple slice here, a watermelon piece there, and gradually eating a salad. Um, I bought some containers, those little ones in a prior video that I'm going to be using to measure my um, salad dressing and I, brought, I bought some um, yogurt based ranch dressing. So I'm going to use that. Um, I've used it before in other things that I eat and it it tastes pretty good so I'm gonna do that um, he checked my incisions and everything seems to be looking fine um, no complaints he said in a year my scars are gonna heal um, and he said it'll be as if I didn't have any so I'm looking forward to that um, regarding my medication he took me off all the medication um, so yay, I'm finally off meds. So I have a couple left and I'm going to take those just for the sake of taking them. But other than that, I'm going to stop. So um, I'm going to go over the vitamins that I take just to let you guys know. And if you guys can recommend anything, um, because I don't have my blood work or anything like that, he wouldn't tell me, he couldn't tell me if I should add or take away any vitamins now. So so right now, um, I'm on these. Take I take two Flintstone vitamins a day. Um, I can take them both at once, or one in the nighttime, one in the daytime. So I got that. Um, I take Biotin 5000. Um, I take that because I do have a lot of hair loss. Um, I did recently cut my hair. I don't know if I talked about that in a prior video, but yeah, I had cut my hair. It was down to my butt, and now it's like down to like here. And um, I did that because the heavy my hair is, and you know when I brush it, more more hair would come out because of brushing my hair. So yeah, so I take that one. Um, I don't. I think I said calcium chew, which I think I did last try. And I take um, Vitamelts, vitamin D three, and um, I take that one. That's what he said to do, and yeah, so when I have headaches or something, I take my Tylenol. I can't take ibuprofen, which I used to be, I used to take um, Motrin and all that, but I can't do that anymore, so boohoo. That's okay, though. New life, it's okay. I did ask the doctor about these things. Remember, in my boo box, um, I asked him. I was more curious about this one, um, but what he told me is that it has the NSAID in it. I don't know if you can see that. 
Um, this was the one for headache, pain, pain, aches, and it helps you sleep. And he said not to take this, just to pass it off to somebody else. So once again, I do have my Tylenol if I if I if I have a headache or a pain, so I take that. And this one, this one, he said I could take it. Um, it has papaya, licorice root, and apple cider vinegar in it, and probably some other stuff. But yeah, he said this one was okay to take, so if I need to take that one, I will. So, um, he said basically continue to do what I'm doing, um, go to the gym, walk, and all that good stuff. So, there's my update for you guys. It's short and sweet and to the point, and... Yeah, so I hope you guys have a good day and stay tuned for more videos. Bye!